Hey bag ladies and bag dudes, I'm Sarah Lawson from So Sweetness and today I'm really excited to introduce you to my four newest projects as part of my four pack video bundle. So these projects are a great assortment of things that I think the whole family will love, which is why I called the bundle of the four patterns and videos his, hers, and furs. So I'm going to introduce you to all of the projects, show you kind of the innards, all of the features of each of the bags, starting with the triple threat briefcase. So this is a great project for taking all of your office supplies on the go. So laptop, file folders, notebooks. This bag has room for all of it and it has different sections for um, all of those items. So let me show you what is in store with the triple threat briefcase. The triple threat briefcase features handles on the front and the back of the bag, as well as decorative accents. I've used rivets to secure my accents. You can use Chicago screws, or you can also just leave the accents blank. As well as the handles, the bag also features an adjustable side strap, and that adjustable strap is removable via the rivets. So if you're not using the adjustable strap, you can just go ahead and remove it either put it to the side or put it inside of the bag and then when you need it, clip it back on. The top of the bag, as you'll notice, features three different zippered compartments. I've used double pull handbag zippers just for ease of having, being able to have the different portions open halfway. The center portion features a lining with slip pockets on both sides. So plenty of storage space to place your laptop. Um, it also features a firm bottom. And then the front and back of the bag portions feature um, optional accordion dividers. So you can place file folders and notebooks in the two different sections. And then the opposite end features the same accordion minus the divider, but also featuring pockets for your gadgets. So cell phone, wallet, whatever you need to put inside this bag has the space for that. The second of the new projects is the Sheffield tool bag. And this bag will hold not only actual tools, but sewing supplies if you're going to a sewing retreat, art supplies, grooming supplies if you're into dogs or cats. Basically, whatever you're into, this bag will carry it. The Sheffield tool bag is a great functional bag. And if you've noticed on front and the back of the bag, there are three-dimensional pockets and then also slip pockets, so plenty of storage space. These pockets are also replicated on the back of the bag. This bag is really fun to sew because there's no curves. It's all straight edge sewing. The top zip closure pops open to reveal the lining, which has those same three-dimensional pockets in the lining. And if you'll notice, the lining actually opens wide this bag is finished with metal frames, so there's a metal frame on each portion, the front and back of the bag. The metal frame is super easy to install, and I feel like it's a, a really nice feature to the bag, and definitely not a floppy bag. Really fun to make, and you can mix and match your fabrics, so you can use several different fabrics to show off your favorite prints. The next of the new projects is the Widget Messenger Bag. The Widget Messenger Bag has lots of surprise storage throughout. While it is small, it is mighty. The Widget Messenger Bag is a great three-dimensional crossbody bag, and it features lots of different storage compartments. But before we get to that, I'd like to mention it also has an adjustable strap and features a zippered pocket on the back of the bag. On the inside is where all the fun starts. So this first main compartment has um, a zippered mesh pocket as well as a zipper pocket directly across from that. And the front compartment features storage space for your cell phone or wallet, hooks for holding pens, and there's also a D-ring which you can clip your keys to if you'd like to. There's an optional grommet on the front of the bag, so if you like to listen to music when you're out and about, you can just go ahead and plug that into your cell phone while keeping your bag safely secured. The fourth and final project in the His, Hers, and Furs video and pattern bundle is the Best Friend Pet Carrier. 
Not only is this a great bag to take your pets along with you, but this also makes a fantastic gym bag just in case you don't have any pets or at least don't have any pets small enough to fit in this bag. The Best Friend Pet Carrier features handles on the front and back of the bag as well as an adjustable strap that clips onto the bag at either end with the D-ring. So there's multiple access areas that this bag features. First of all, there's two zippers along the top of the bag that unzip as well as secure the top of the bag with Velcro so you can insert your pet into the bag at the top as well as inserting them on either end. So either side features the same zipper and the bag is really sturdy with the use of metal frames. So the bag won't collapse as the pet is trying to enter the metal frames for a total of four, two in the front and two in the back. Keep everything nice and secure. This mesh on the front and back of the bag is breathable mesh. So that I use pet safe vinyl coated mesh and the bag can hold the weight of the pet using a wooden board. So you can use either plywood or hardboard and this is very secure. It can hold about 18 to 20 pounds depending on the pet and it also has a really nice cozy bed inside for your pet's comfort. I hope you enjoyed that detailed look at the four projects that are part of my His, Hers, and Furs Volume 1 bundle. The bundle includes the four PDF patterns to make all of the projects as well as detailed videos. The PDF patterns include full color step photos as well as my sewing instructions for each of the projects. And the videos are full length videos so I make the entire projects from start to finish. So grab your bundle and come sew along with me.